Max, um, I'm speaking to you and not on Twitter uh, for once. Max, what needs to happen at the moment? <laughs> yeah, morning, Aaron. Uh, um, yeah, just like Michaela said, it's a, it's a really rough time to support Forrest at the moment. In fact, it's probably more than rough. It's just um, it's just disappointing. Forrest is at bottom, obviously, one point and, and no wins still, which is unbelievable to say this long into the season. I mean, Forrest are quite lucky because... Blackpool and Peterborough um, lost yesterday, meaning, you know, there is a chance that the gap is not too um, big now and, and, and Forrest can make it up if we win tonight. But in, in terms of what needs to happen, I think, um, probably like Michaela said, uh, I think Chris Hewitt needs to go. There's no connection between him and the fans. Um, and I don't think there's any really re real connection between the, cl the club and the fans fans at the moment and that's um really sad to see um considering how it was kind of pre-pandemic and under Sabri Lamucci as well so the manager going I think it'd be a good start but also just getting our Forest back a bit of communication would be nice from from Forest and to the fans as well because I think fans are sick of it you know it's the same old every year and it's and, and, and it's miserable for young fans you know us young fans that I've much to shout about at, at least the older generation um had something to see and and enjoy back in the day <laughs> <laughs> yeah tell me about it my first season ticket with a mate was under the David Platt season um oh. now Max when you when you look at this and a lot of people have had um heated discussions that's what happens when football goes this way but in reality the transfer window is now closed the, mm -hmm. the squad is there until january chris hewton has got and i'm just playing devil's advocate here chris hewton has got a brilliant track record where he's been beforehand what what changes by bringing someone else in given the way the club is at the moment i i, I think the way um a manager can motivate the players i i, I think it's sometimes talked about a lot in football that managers don't have the squad or that football clubs need to be Stability. Football clubs need stability in many ways. Stability comes in lots of different forms, but you can't get stability when you sat bottom of the, the, the league and the players don't seem to be playing for the manager. I actually don't think the players um, aren't playing for Chris Newton at the moment. I think they're still going for it, um, but I think a new face would, would motivate um, the team and, and, and perhaps a young manager as well to get the best out of the academy players because we seem to be um, utilising those at the moment as well. I feel like you're trying to throw yourself in the mix there, Max. Well, exactly. I was going to say, if if Forrest want to give me the call, I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure how I, how I feel about that, let alone anyone else. Max, thank you very much. Michaela, thank you very much.